Oh dear. Yeah, no, I know that. Mm-hmm. Really. Please, you, you you both don't have to fly out to New York. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I have plenty of money. Oh. I told you. I told you. The moment I know something, you and Mom are the first people I'm going to call. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes. I'm gonna be fine. Is it? Yes. Next week. Three months worth. Yes. Mm hmm. No. I, I'm gonna be able to visit for Christmas. Yeah. Dad, I just. Just let's let me feel normal for once. Just. I know you love me. I, I love you too. And mom. I, uh huh. Look, just just tell Adam I love him too, okay? I just, I, Dad, Dad, I, I gotta go. I, I gotta go. I gotta go. Yeah, I love you too. Yeah, I love you. So it finally begins, my friend. Okay, look at it. Tell me she's gonna love it. What is it? It's my future. Open it. Wow. Really, this? I, I know, it's soon, like, real soon, but dude, you can't deny when it feels right. <laughs> um, I'm really happy for you. Good. Thanks. Man, this is it. I'm ready. You okay? What? Yeah, no, I'm fine. I'm fine. It's a long day. Are you crying? No. Stop pushing your buns again. Man, that woman needs to go. <laughs> yeah, it's funny you say that. Hey, you gotta stop letting him manipulate you. You know, funny thing happened. I, I got an actual prescription from a doctor to break up with her. Smart doctor. <laughs> Dr. Cassandi Gastroenterology? It's diarrhea, it's nothing. Yeah, it's all that Mexican food. Told you deep eating restaurants are a no. Me loving Mexican food has nothing to do with it. It's... It's my belly, man. It's having issues. It's... It's nothing. It's... You know what? Back to you. Why do you think this girl, who I haven't met, is gonna say yes to the amazing William? Oh, dude, she's like everything I ever wanted. She's, she's smart, she's funny. She's attractive, sexy, and she like loves all the things I like. And her uncle had a heart attack at the same age as my uncle. Oh. Well, so how come you haven't brought her around, man? Eh? The girl's busy. I can't, I can't make her feel bad for that. You're compassionate, really. I'm happy for you. So when are you going to pop the big question? <laughs> Next month. She's coming to visit. Does she live in New Jersey? Nah. If she did, I would have gone to see her already. Spanaway, Washington. No wonder she hasn't been able to come see us. So, wait, is this the girl you said that was like really wealthy? Hit the jackpot. <laughs> it's, it's not about that. I mean, love transcends things, you know. I mean, yeah, she owns her own jewelry store. I mean, well, her family owns it, not her. Yeah. Oh, and a uh, bistro. Apparently, it's a super popular Italian spot. Does she manage it? No, get this. She's the master chef there. But she only does that a couple days a week. The rest of the time, she runs her own clothing boutique store. She must be so busy with... Do you guys have any time to like video chat or anything? We always plan to, but I, I, I can't blame her for having to cancel. Plus her stupid father keeps giving her a hard time. How does that make you feel? I'm trying to be compassionate. I, like I don't want to push her or pressure her. I mean, with her mom being in the hospital and stuff. I, that's one of the reasons why she's moving out here, you know, get away from her father. Can I, um, can I be real with you? Yeah, always. We've, uh, Look, 
We've known each other since what? Seventh grade? Yeah, man. Get me till the end. So, um, no, I'm, I'm telling you this because I love you. But I honestly... Look, man, I, I think she's lying to you. Lying to me? Dude, I've been talking for like <clears throat> six months nonstop. I, I would have picked up on craziness like that by now. You're right. Yeah, look, I'm sorry. I, uh... No. Hey, hey. I know you're only looking after me. That's why I want you to be my best man. Oh, wow. I'm, I'm honored. Really, uh... I'm really happy for you. Awesome. Hey, listen, keep your schedule open for next June. I need you by my side. Absolutely. I, I wouldn't miss it for the world, man. And speaking of love, I'm going to go text her. All right. Let her know that uh, I can't wait to meet her. <laughs> Mr. Stefano. Yeah, Chris went for a walk. No, I left the cell phone here and... What? Uh, of, of course. Yes, Mr. Stefano. Uh, of course, Mr. Stefano. I, I promise I won't leave him alone. I, I promise. Yes, Mr. Stefano. I saw him for a moment. I'll be with him every step. No, no, no need to take me, Mr. Stefano. He's fa we're all family. I love you too. Yeah, first moment I see him. Thank you for telling me, Mr. Stefano. Okay, of course. Bye, Mr. Stefano. you call this it's just let me hear your voice for the first time no no of course I love you it, it, it's just I know you're going through a lot and I just... yeah yeah and and I, I just found out my best friend has stage four cancer No, I, I know it took a lot for you to call. Yes, with all you're going through. Y you know what, look, I I'm sorry. 
my friend needs me. Look, let me call you back and we'll be... She just hang up on me. Thank you.